five years ago yesterday, Kimberly beat Sun Prairie at Camp Randall Stadium, capping off a remarkable run of five straight state championships and a state record 70 consecutive wins. Today, the papermakers were back looking to win their first state title since as they face off against Baguanago, the champion of the Classic 8 Conference and what turned out to be a classic game at Camp Randall. The papermakers trailed 14-7 at the half, but they kick off a wild second stanza with a score off the play fake, Seth Myron to Ethan Kreider, a 48-yard catch and run. We're tied at 14. Baguanago answers back on the next drive. Mason Radovicki, their third string running back, playing due to injury, scampers in on a 10-yard touchdown, extra point blocked, so it's 20 to 14. Ensuing Kimberly drive inside the five, so that means it's Blake Berry time. The star running back scores to put his guys up 21 to 20. McGuanago took the lead on a field goal, but Kimberly answers back. Their offense was humming, and it's Barry again as they retake the lead 27-23. More from McGuanago. Evan Herbing, the quarterback with a short rushing touchdown, and they are back on top, 30-27 with less than five minutes to play. Kimberly, though, responds with a brilliant clock-milking drive, and I guess who finishes it off? It's Barry with TD number four. The papermakers take the lead, 26 seconds to go. Last chance for McGuanago. Thomas Myers picks off Herbig, and the celebration is on. Kimberly back on top, a 34-30 win. John Miller in Madison. This is what dreams are made of. You could not have asked for a better Division I state title game right here at Camp Randall as Kimberly and McGuanago duked it out back and forth. In the end, it came down to a touchdown with 26 seconds left to give the papermakers the victory. And the guy scoring that touchdown was a guy they relied on all season long, Blake Berry. He scored his fourth rushing touchdown to give the papermakers the 2022 Division I state title. Feeding the ball at 26 seconds left, scoring that touchdown. That's what dreams are made of, right? Is that something you've dreamed about since you were a kid? Yeah, I mean, that's something that you think about when you're working out in the tough days when you really don't want to do it. And that's just the kind of things that you think about in those moments that keep making you, like, push and feels great. Well, we looked at him uh, in the huddle and in the, in the line as well, and we said, you know, this is why you do the hills. This is why we're, you know, one of the top squat you know, high schools in the state of Wisconsin, lean on it and move the line of scrimmage. And we wore them down a little bit and just an unbelievable rushing performance. So Kimberly puts a bow on their 2022 high school football season. And that's a wrap to the 2022 high school football season here at NBC 26. But I'm John Miller reporting from Camp Randall.